Okay, this is April, and I'm going to show you how we can paint some of these beautiful leaves using four different brushes. We're going to be using the Traditions paints, which are professional grade acrylic paints by Deco Art, and their brushes. And we have the filber, an angle, and a flat brush with our liner. The liner will help us make our stems. So let's get started, and I'm going to start off first with our filbert brush and a filbert brush is a flat brush that has a rounded top and it will make nice pretty leaves now the stroke i'm going to show you here we're going to um, hold the brush between our thumb and our index finger and we're going to roll that brush into a nice little point at the tip okay so we are touching slow little pressure roll the brush and nice little point there you go, and one more time. Push down, roll the brush between your fingers, and then lift. You always get the nice shape there. And let's add our stem. And remember, whenever you use your liner brush, you wanna make sure you add water so that it thins out the paint a little bit. Okay, there's your stem. And let's switch to our second brush, which is our uh, flat brush. I'm going to load the brush the same way. Entire brush with the dark green. One corner we're going to pick up with our yellow blend back and forth. Let's pick up a little touch of white to even lighten that even more. And this leaf is similar to this one here but a little different. So there's a little pressure chisel pressure slowly start to release pressure and end on your chisel so one more time chisel push down slowly start to release pressure and end on your chisel so the shape is similar but slightly different and let's just use our chisel edge and paint our stem okay and then i'm going to show you another leaf using the same brush loading it the same way but this will be a slightly larger leaf this will have a have two sides a left and a right using the same brush we're going to lay our chisel at this angle right here. Slight little pressure as we pull, rotate that outside of the brush and then release pressure end on your tippy toe. Pick up a little more paint. And now we're gonna add the left side. So chisel, slight little pressure, pull down, rotate that outside and connect at the bottom right here and add your stem. See how pretty that is? Very simple. One more brush. This is our angle. And an angle brush has a short side and a long side. The long side is your toe and the short side is the heel. We're going to load the brush, entire brush with green. And then our toe, we're gonna pick up yellow blend back and forth and remember you there are a lot of different shades of greens you can use and choose whichever one you like let's pick up a little more here and we're going to start at the bottom and we're going to just move the brush upwards with a little pressure and releasing pressure. So it's a nice, tall, skinny leaf that you see like maybe for a tulip or an iris. So here, releasing pressure. So let me do that one more time. I added the light on the hook, on the toe and we're gonna lead with our heel. So chisel slowly start to add the pressure 
pressure, 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 and then right about here, slowly start to release pressure and then end on your chisel. So that's a really pretty leaf. One more leaf. This one is a little tricky. It's got a flip in it. So it's the same brush, but a leaf that's kind of falling where it has a little flip at the bottom or at the top. So we're going to lead with our heel. Slight little pressure there. Turn that brush. And then right here, we lean upwards with our toe. See that? Let me do that one more time. Need a little more paint. So we using the angle brush, load it up really well. The toe will have the lighter color. So I picked up yellow, blend it really well. I'm gonna pick up a little bit of white, blend it, blend it, make sure there's a lot of paint. Okay, so here, chisel, slowly start to add pressure and then slowly rotate the outside now, right about here, you're going to start slowly releasing pressure, and this long toe will flip over, and then we pull to a nice little chisel edge. And that is a little tricky, but with a little practice, you can do it too. Not too hard. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, thank you for watching, and hope to see you soon.